Alright guys, here we are in the wonderful world of Monster Jam. Now, I know for the most part, most of you guys are probably pretty, pretty dang familiar with this area right here. This is pretty much where I start every single one of my Monster Jam. <laughs> what, what the heck just happened? But, this is where I start pretty much every single one of my Monster Jam videos. If you guys missed last episode, it was actually insane we went ahead and finished up the world championship finally getting the career mode 100 percent complete and out of the way and we can move on that's what we're doing here today so if we go ahead and actually take a look at the world map you guys can see that there's actually a decent amount of stuff to do within the free roam area now i have checked out a bunch of the tracks and stuff in previous events that we've already done on the channel like Titans Grove over here in Gecko Flats. We've done this track and yeah, I think there are going to be some hidden things that we haven't found. So I'm just going to explore. That's the plan for this episode. If you guys enjoy, you already know the drill. Smash that thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's get in to some Sandy Monster Jam madness. Oh, I think it's actually crazy. Look at this. If you zoom in, you can literally see like every single detail of the map. Oh my goodness. All right. I think we got to check this out. Do you guys think we can get on this like rock barrier? That would be wild. So, all right. Now that I have won the world championship, I'm basically rich. I have like so much money. So I think it's time to actually pimp out one of these DLC cars. I think that is the plan. The Fire and Ice DLC did come out a while back and it was a video I made on the channel. I did do a video on it, but other than that, I haven't actually used any of the trucks, played with any of them or anything. So that's what we're gonna do today. Let's pimp out Yeti. And it looks like it takes about 60,000 credits to fully upgrade a truck. That's actually, Wow, that's crazy. All right, here we go. Let's go explore. It's time to get Sandy. Go off-roading in the monster truck. Use the power. Man, monster trucks are insanely powerful. So we got to use that power to our advantage. Oh, and let's see where we can end up getting, all right? Destroy some cactus. That is A-OK. -okay. Holy. Are we, like, on top of the map right now? This is... This is beautiful. <laughs> that could be a thumbnail right there, man. That is actually, wow. We are like, we are like on top of the world. So I think this is only the beginning of the, the madness here in Monster Jam Free Roam. I think it would be absolutely insane if they dropped, oh, are we going to be able to ride out of this? Nope. <laughs> Yeah, the game comes with one area to, I mean, explore, but sometimes people want more, right? And DLC can actually pull people to buy the game and spend more money, so who knows? I think it'd be cool. I know I would spend my money on <laughs> on a DLC like that because clearly already we're having some fun here in this free roam area. There are going to be some wild jumps. We can obviously find some collectibles. Oh, there are actually like jumps built here. Oh, can we transfer down in? Oh, we case a little bit, but that's pretty sweet. So I'm down over here. I wonder where the cool stuff is. What should we go check out? This looks like a gnarly canyon. Oh my goodness. The dustpan over here. I think we got to go check that out at some point. This is like a gas station. I kind of want to go explore over there. There's like a soap tree in. There's so much going on. We were pretty much already over here looking at the gas station area. Yeah, it's this area with the jumps and everything. So, I mean, <laughs> wild. Should I try and find a send? A gnarly old send here at the gas stop. Oh, <laughs> It's actually hilarious. The trucks are so powerful that, uh, yeah, you, you can use the engine and just send it off of stuff. Things can go south really, really, really quick, but that is a-okay. Can we get up? There we go. Look at the size of our, our monster truck compared to this, like, hot rod car I just found. Oh my goodness, this thing is a giant. Is this the soap tree in? This is, this is the soap tree in. Oh my goodness. Is that the sign for it? Tell me that's the sign. Let me just, let me just turn around real quick. Monster truck definitely has a lot of power, but doesn't turn that good. Soap tree in motel. 
Free AC color TV round beds best prices no pets coin laundry man This is the place you guys want to be out in the middle of the desert with probably nothing going on in the area This train probably comes through at prime time just to annoy you and wake you up in the middle of the night It is your number one vacation spot spring tree inn is that what it's called? Soap tree. I didn't even say the name right. <laughs> There's nothing going on there. It just looks like a rundown motel. <laughs> all right, I found a jump, I think. If all goes to plan. Oh, oh, okay. That was pretty cool. Um, I thought we were gonna get a little more air, but I guess not. Boulder Bend Campground. What do you got to offer, my man? There is a, um, what do you call those? A collectible. Yeah, that's what you call it. Collectible right there. I could go ahead and grab that. Okay, maybe we are not grabbing the collectible. Where is it? I don't even see it. I don't see it anywhere. Am I close to it? It's like way over to my right more. Um, I'm totally not, <laughs> not looking in the right spot. Oh, it's legitimately just sitting on the ground right here. Okay, I thought it was gonna be like in the sky and we were gonna have to jump for it, but I guess not. So that's pretty cool. I mean, I do wanna see what we can get up to just kind of sending it off on our own but it does look like they've actually went ahead and put in some pretty dang cool areas to explore here within this free roam map so like i said earlier man i really do think it'd be something that they could do as dlc free roam maps and just get creative with it um i'm gonna have to try that again but i feel like i feel like the arches are a type of object that the trucks actually do not like driving on. It'd kind of be like driving on a rock. I could be wrong. It could have just been a fluke. Oh, that's my bad. Yeah, I messed up. Oh, um, yep. Sayonara. Oh, we landed on a tree. Maybe third time's the charm. And uh, even though our truck is no longer looking, <laughs> looking like Yeti, that, that's sad. Look at how ugly it looks now. Hopefully, we can at least get out and over here this time. I don't know, man, that drop. Oh, yeah, the truck drives fine, man. I was just being a goof earlier. Okay, cool. Okay, maybe not. Oh, we're sliding. Oh, that works. Should we go back this way? <laughs> yeah, guys, I'm coming back, climbing up the wall. Oh, man. That's just a perfect example of how monster trucks have so much power if this is like in any way close to being accurate to how um yeah i can't i can't see my truck <laughs> but look at this man if they have that amount of power in real life it's crazy like absolutely wild oh where am i going okay so before i break the game i think we're just gonna go ahead and teleport somewhere else uh old soda springs here we go <laughs> checking it out it does look like uh Kind of a big open field with a hill climb over here. Or is this going out of bounds? I guess we're about to out of bounds. Oh no, 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 no. I don't know what track this is, but I found a track. I found a track. Oh, this is totally the, uh, I don't even know what it is called, but it's just an outdoor kind of national style track. Wide open, fast, flowy, and yo, Yeti. Why are you chilling on your side, man? I think I have actually done a video on this track. If I didn't do a video on it, I definitely played it in a live stream. It's nothing crazy, nothing too special, but it is cool. And I wish, I don't know, I really wish like the career mode implemented these tracks into the into it. Like implement these tracks into the career mode. It could add, I mean, a little more depth to it rather than just doing the, uh, the stadium head-to-head -head freestyle challenges, two-wheel skill events, like, kind of change it up a little bit, right? I have, like, one piece of my body left on my truck, and it's, like, acting like a wing right now, flapping in the breeze when we hit jumps and stuff, but, uh, let's go explore that track. Like I said, I think I've done a video on it. If I haven't, I know Twitchy has. I'm not sure if anyone else has, but I have seen a video from Twitchy on that track, and I know that for a fact okay sometimes man i think i'm just cursed and like i'm bound to end up on my roof because like it just it just happens you know i want to say if we go this way it's out of the map yeah okay perfect 
Maybe this will send us to a new place where we can explore. <laughs> we actually downsided onto the road. Oh, that was pretty much perfect. Let's get out of here. Hold it wide open. Let's go look for some jumps. There's a collectible right here. Maybe we should try and grab that. Are we gonna get it right here? Not going to happen. All right, I got a feeling we gotta come at it like this way or something. Oh yeah, oh, we are gone. We're going to the moon. <laughs> That works though. We got it. Oh, there's like a secret secret bunker down here, man. If the zombies ever attack, you can find your boy Goonzig down here, okay? Oh, the UFO. Okay, buddy boy. Buddy boy, what is that? Someone actually told me about that before. I didn't believe them, but here it is, man. I don't know what's going on over there. At Rainbow THQ Nordic man, I don't know what's going on what you guys are up to. I don't want any I don't want any part of it <laughs> Get me out of here. Oh cuz the air base is right here. Oh that actually makes so much sense There's like an airport right here. Oh, and then they hide the UFO over over there Interesting man play bowling with these barrels in here. Just oh, oh, oh wow. Wow. They actually slowed me down a ton They must be full. I thought they were empty, but you know they must be full <laughs> If they're full of gas, I'm surprised they didn't explode. Wow, they're not even like rolling down the hill. Wow, physics, logic, that makes 100% sense. <laughs> I think once again, the airbase is filled with kind of crazy jumps and stuff where we can get wild and rowdy, but I see three collectibles over here. How am I supposed to get those? Cause there is no way, no way I'm jumping off of that to get them. Do we hit this jump? Is that all we do? So if I'm being like 100% honest, now that we've found that UFO, I'm kind of thinking, or at least getting the feeling that if I spent like some more time and actually looked, looked harder on this map, I feel like I would actually find some probably pretty crazy stuff. Like I feel like the UFO is not the only hidden thing within this whole entire map. So uh, maybe I'll have to spend some time exploring and actually look through the map in depth thoroughly to actually see if if there is anything else throughout the map because that is man that's awesome can i get this collectible from here can i oh baby food easy i'm not making the jump though oh wow the free roam area is actually awesome i think it's so cool man so cool that you can just come in and explore <laughs> on a monster truck, in a monster truck. It reminds me of Forza for some reason. Like, it really does. Forza Horizon 4, the desert area. Oh, we're going out of bounds. Let me turn. Let me turn, man. So that's pretty much, I mean, I wouldn't say it for the map, but we checked out the south end. We kind of checked out the northern end. I feel like there are definitely, <laughs> this is the arch that we were on when the truck was driving all funky, but I feel like there are definitely some hidden things within the map. We kind of just got to like, I mean, look for them, right? Few collectibles over here, collectible up on this ridge here, and for the most part, is that, like, that literally looks like a hole in the earth, but uh, yeah. Oh, there's no way this is a jump. Oh, I have to go check this out. Like I said, guys, I do think for the most part, man, I'm only scratching the surface of this free roam map. There is totally a ton of stuff that we could get lost trying to do within this map. Look at all the collectibles. I see three right here on my screen and I'm rolling the truck. Okay. So this should be like a send. I'm pretty sure a big old send up and over the canyon. Oh, that's a unreal. Absolutely unreal. I love it. This game is insane. I hope you guys enjoyed the sends here in Monster Jam Steel Titans. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to smash that thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Man, if you guys want, I will go ahead and just explore in this game. Like, this is this is wild. What are we doing right now? Where are we going, man? The terrain is absolutely unreal. Like, I'm, I'm way down in the canyon right now. We were, at the start of the episode, we were, like, way, way up at the mountaintops. Like, this is absolutely unreal. I hope you guys enjoyed. What did I just find? Little campsite in the bottom the bottom of the canyon let's send it up here see if we can actually make it anywhere look at that power of the monster truck man we almost made it that's where i'm ending it i hope you enjoyed peace